Hey there, minions of technology. My name is Tim Lee. Welcome to Legacy Studio, where today we're going to try something a bit different than what you're used to seeing us play with the Mist and the Riven and the Cyan games. We're going to try Ranch Sim. That's right. Want to try something different? Have a little bit of fun? Let me know what you think. Let's get into this. we got to create a character. Let's go to create character. All right. That guy has a lot more hair than I do. Thankfully, they did pick a male. What's a female look like? Just out of curiosity. Ah! Looks like that girl from uh, The wake, uh, the uh, Walking Dead. Okay. Alright. Let's go to general for starters. Skin tint. Okay. Uh, he has been drinking too much. And he's as white as a sheet, which most Montanans are, but I'm kind of in between right there. Okay. Next up, Hugh. Oh, gosh. We can make him look green and sickly. <laughs> We're just going to stick with that. Saturation. Wow, this is highly detailed, which is kind of cool. Um, okay, dead or slightly alive. Okay, we're going to kind of go middle ground here. Skin roughness. I don't see much when it comes to skin roughness, so I'm just going to kind of... I It's kind of, I guess it's more shiny. Okay. Hair stubble. Well, admittedly, I got a lot of hair stubble. Beard stubble. Actually, I don't have any hair stubble. We'll turn it on for the moment. Body hair. I don't usually actually have much body hair. Don't ask why. <laughs> Ear shape. Um, kind of tiny on the ears. Head shape. Yeah. I keep looking at myself on the camera trying to see how close I'm getting. Okay. Uh, moving on to hair. Hairstyle. Five. Wow. Afro buzz. Unfortunately. What's up with all the freckles? Can I get rid of the freckles? Is that the hair stubble? <laughs> That's the hair stubble. <laughs> well, unfortunately, I do have some, so we'll go... <laughs> <laughs> okay, hair color, black, though you really can't tell. Uh, mustache, standard. Actually, I do this every now and then. Should we do it real quick? I, I actually have the stuff literally right here. Watch, watch. Uh, hats off pomade. So let's grab a little bit of this really quick here. There we are, just like that. There we go, nice big gloop of it. Okay, let me move my... My wife hates this look. I find it delightful. <laughs> there we go. See? I can do that. I almost think I can do better than he can. Hats off. High hold pomade. It smells good, too. Made in the USA. So, uh, any other... Oh, no, wait. We're going bald. <laughs> So we have that, normal, and handlebar. We're going handlebar. Hair color is black. Saturation, brightness, and all that as well. The nose. I better get a choice on a beard. You're not going to give me a beard? Oh, here we go. That's all I can have? A soul patch? That's it? Oh, that's evil. Wow. Come on. Go all the way, for Pete's sake. Whatever. Okay. Nose. Size. And I can't turn him. Oh, wait a minute. Hold to move the head. Okay. Look that way for me, sir. Okay. First off, it's a larger nose. But it's not large nostril-wise. Curve. I do actually have a small curve, so that's fine. Tip. Where's the little tip? There's the tip. <laughs> Tip angle. I'm kind of uh, a medium tip, so I'm going to... About right there. See? There's the tip. <laughs> okay. Oh, no shape. Well, I didn't realize that they had multiple nos schnozzles. See, mine's weird because it's tiny 
from nostril to nostril, like 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 this guy. And yet, um, tip angle. Can't. No one can beat my nose. My nose rocks. Eyes, eyes, hue for eyes. I have a weird eye color that my wife loves, for the record. So if it'll let me get it, yeah, there we go. Kind of there-ish. Maybe a little bit more. People confuse me between green, blue, and and hazel. Like like all kinds of crazy. Libel ring. Wow, how crazy detailed does that get? That's cool. Pupil size, so I can freak either it can either freak people out or look like I went to the eye doctor. I personally think that for guys like me, the pupil size is pretty small. Eye shape. Where's the longest and squintiest eyes you got? Actually, that looks pretty good. Yeah, about that, I think. All right, eye shape. Height. This is... <laughs> Hello. I talk with my eyes, not with my mouth. It's a family thing. Runs in the genes. Okay, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. I, I, let's see if I sits there. Depth. Oh man, how much were you drinking that day? I was drinking not this much, but this much. Not this much, but this much. I think we're just gonna kind of go in a little bit because I do feel like mine are in there. Size. Okay. <laughs> this is so much more fun than the game probably is. Large, tiny, large, tiny. Diabetic, tiny, <laughs> and narrow. Mine are pretty. Well, I feel I've always felt that mine were pretty narrow, but we'll go with that. So far, it looks nothing like me. Okay, eyebrows. Yeah, let's just go with that. Okay, saturation. Can we do something like really crazy, like instead of like? Nothing's happening. Oh, brightness. <laughs> Can you say no? <laughs> okay, we're going to fix that. Uh, let's see. Brow shape. Oh, that's cool. My eyes, my eyebrows kind of sit just above my eyes. And, and like I said, as a caricature artist for many, many years, I'm, I'm a quick person to judge how my eyes are <clears throat> brow height okay we're gonna we're gonna take it pretty low I hope they have glasses uh, oh and how far do they come out mine don't come out that far so so far it looks nothing like me okay lip color yes I like lipstick <laughs> let's get rid of that real quick okay uh, brightness doesn't matter Lip shape. I don't know. I think I, I'm kind of okay with what we had there. We'll go about there. Size, height, depth. Hopefully, all that covers up by a nice beard and goatee. Okay, jaw. Jaw height. Jaw height. Okay. Jaw width. Doesn't really matter. Underbite. I technically do have a bit of an underbite chin size I technically hide mine <laughs> though probably it probably is tucked in a bit more but we're gonna go with medium chin width mine's actually pretty there we go chin height okay we're gonna go about like that I think okay body I have a body age I'm actually pretty young-ish looking-ish. So, muscle mass. <laughs> um, I do have a bit of muscle mass, but it's not perfect. Muscular. I have a little bit. We'll go about there. Wait. Unfortunately, that's where things go wrong. Oh gosh, it's in my face. So we'll go about here. No, unfortunately, a bit more. There we go. Okay, <laughs> and apparel. Please give me glasses. 
All right, t-shirt. I get to pick my t-shirt. No. What's this one? <laughs> He's got a six pack. Yeah, that's not how that goes down. Oh, that's fun. Casual shirt. Oh, you see, now there you go. That's more me. Yeah. I, I'm a casual shirt kind of guy. Definitely not that kind of guy, though. I like, I like... See, I kind of like that. I like that. Jacket. Okay, that's the upper body. Lower body. Jeans. Underwear. <laughs> jeans. Do some light jeans. Got any... Oh, great jeans. Cool. Cargo pants. Suit pants. For being a rancher. Gosh. Socks. Sneaker one. Sneaker two. Actually, that's almost perfect in comparison to my sneakers. Are we good with this? Okay, good. Just making sure. Sneakers, sandals, boots, dress shoes. Okay. Hats. Pitched for... Pinched front, cattleman, gambler. I'd say none. Glasses! That is literally the only choice you're going to give me, huh? That is it. You realize that is not even close to what my glasses look like. How do uh, sunglasses look? No different, you cheap, cheat skates. All right, we're going aviators because I can't stand all the other options. Okay, save. Um, that's 11 minutes out of the 20 minute video that we're supposed to be playing. <laughs> oh gosh, when, when, when just creating the character is so much more fun than playing the game. Are you sure? Yes, I think. Okay, here we go. Now what's going to happen? New game. Connect. Customize character options. We're going new game. Name your game. Legacy Studio. Okay. <laughs> I hope you're enjoying this, friends. Uh, and welcome to the channel. If you're new here, uh, I, I just play so many games here. Uh, I hope that you enjoy it. So WASD to move. Uh, look around with this. Uh, sprint with shift. Crouch with C. Jump. With space and hold V to change the camera view. Okay. So we're going to enter. And, uh, all right. There we go. Okay. So, uh, so far I can do the weirdest jig ever. Follow the blue kind, blue icon. So here's crouch. Okay. And we can run. No auto run. It's too bad. All right. So feel like I'm about to play a weird episode of Call of Duty. Press E to enter. And here we go. Over to the PayPal. And E to read. Hello, grandchild. No, oh, excuse me. Hello, grandchild. If you read this letter, then you agreed to fulfill my last will and come to our family wrench. It is desolate because I didn't have the time and opportunity to deal with it. Come into the house. I left a few things in the attic that will help you. I believe in you, your loving grandfather. Okay. And my mustache is getting stuck on my microphone. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay. E to put back. Open quest log by pressing J. Okay. Whatever. All right. Enter to continue. Uh, turn on the radio on the wall. Find the tent. Okay. So we're going to turn on the radio on the wall. Let's run over. I know the tent was closer, but I'm a man on a mission. This is what I do. It looks like I'm going into a real... Oh, boy, Grandpa, what did you leave me with? Oh, this is ugly. Okay, E to open. Ow! Oh, I literally cannot... I have to close the... Press E to close. Open. Sheesh. Okay. This thing seems to be glitching a little bit, so bear with me on this. Um, turn on the radio on the wall. Ow! Okay, very glitchy game so far. That is not a radio on the wall. Okay, it's on. Okay. <laughs> Okay. 
Wow. Lovely house. Okay. All right. We're going to run back over here now. I hope this is a lot less glitchy in the recording than it is on my screen. All right. Here's the tent. Hold R to save game and E to sleep. All right. We're going to hold R and save the game. Here you can sleep until morning and save your progress anytime. Okay. Remove the obstacle. Find the chest upstairs. Let's go back to the house. You're going, wow, he's really doing a great job playing this game. Yes, I am. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, here we go. Let's run back in here. Oh, so glitchy. So glitchy. Let me check my settings here really quick and see if we have a way to alter these settings a little. Gamma resolution. We're going to go with uh, high instead of epic. Uh, view distance. We'll put that on high as well. Apply. And escape. Okay. Hopefully that'll be a little better. All right. So far, not much better. But anyway, we'll see what happens. Um, okay. So... Oh, that's fun. Oh, I can walk past it. Okay. To destroy or remove items, select the demolish mode in the circle menu. Hold tab. Demolish. Press to remove. I'm going to use this to walk across here for now. Uh, okay. Oh, here we go. All right. Um, let me go ahead and hit okay. And we'll get out of... Ah. Is this what I'm looking for? This chest? Like, uh, I just don't want to fall. E to open. <laughs> yes, thank you, Grandpa. Okay. Take this revolver. No, excuse me. Take this revolver! In the forest there, there are many wild animals that can cause you trouble. I've left some money and ammo. One more thing. You'll need a car. In the garage at the entrance to the ranch, there's an old UTV. You'll need to, you to use spare parts you can find here to fix it up. Good luck! Thank you, Grandpa. Okay. At least I got... Now, UTV. That's a utility vehicle. So, what's the difference between a UTV and an ATV? Because I've always wanted an ATV, but if you're just giving me a UTV... All right, anyway, let's see here. It's a joke that wasn't going to end well anyway. Lots of really ugly looking bedrooms, but yes. And very awkward music. Do you like the classics? No. Okay. So we're going to pray that that's not copyright infringement. <laughs> All right, what are we at so far? We're at uh, 18 minutes. We're doing good. Okay, so we got to find tires and seats and all kinds of stuff. So let's do some quick running here. So far, I'm very intrigued by the game because it's also mentioning the idea that you need to go hunting uh, among other... Th oh, in here, I would assume. Oh, hey. Hello. That could work. How do we get in here? Okay, there we go. Hi, UTV, I see. Um, press E to install. Um, okay. All right. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Here we go. Okay. Couldn't have just done this before you died out of curiosity? No? You didn't know. Okay, there we go. It's two tires. Two tires. Oh. We got gas. Pick up the item. Hold the right click to start placement. Press the left to confirm the placement. Okay. Well, oop. What? I have no idea what I just did. Oh, there it is. I was trying to put it in the back of the UTV. So, press. Okay. All right, that went well so far. Okay. Anyway, we got we got other things to do first. There we go. Let me open the door that leads to nowhere and another one of these. Cause that's the way I carry tires in real life. 
out in front, arm stretch wide. Let's go ahead and uh, boop. There we go. So I need one more tire somewhere. Let's get rid of this thing because that's annoying me. Okay. No, but like I was saying, I mean, I literally have Farming Simulator, which is really advanced and crazy. But this one just seemed like it was the step. Oh, lucky me. Uh, like it was the step below that, but kind of with a twist because it had hunting and things like that that the other one didn't. And so it looked kind of like a life simulator in a way. I was like, this is interesting. You know, I, I, I find it intriguing. Oh, here we go. Uh, oop, oop, oh, pick up. There we go. Anything? Yes, that's the way I hold a chair. Okay, anyway, let's go and... Bumper guard and fuel tank. Well, I definitely have the fuel tank, right? Um, yeah. Goosh. Oh! Not what I meant to do. Okay. And E to install. Okay, so we have this. Wouldn't this be the fuel tank? Um, it's not really showing where it would go if it was there. So, and it's not telling me to install it, so apparently they don't consider a jerry can a fuel tank. Okay. Uh, oh, but what is this? That looks like a fuel tank. Ah, ha, ha. Okay, good. So technically this thing should drive now, but you're going to make me get another seat. Okay, um... Oh, well, look at this. Now, I'm just realizing there's a blue dot above this. Has everything already, like, been placed? And I've been finding all this myself without <laughs> realizing that there's already, like, little dots above it because I've been so focused. I've seen myself do that before. Come on now. Boosh. There we go. So, okay. Is there another blue dot somewhere? There's something over here. See, I wish I could just turn on auto run. Oh, wait. Right here? Yep. Oh, man. So they. That's just cheating. Come on. Make me hunt for it. Whatever. If you do enjoy this game, make sure to hit that like button for me. Pretty please. That way I know to keep playing it. What I do is I play a couple, a couple you know, levels and see about how people like it. And if people like it, then I move on and we do more. Oh, ignition. Okay, I see. Well, first off, I got a jerry can in my way, so let's put that over here. And let's go ahead and do ignition. Nice. Okay. Space to handbrake. Oh, gosh, you can slide to a halt. C to hitch. Place a jerry can on the UTV car. Go bad! Using... Okay, I kind of already did that, but... Let's just do this and e-brake it. Oh, ho, 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 ho. that just got a lot more fun. Okay, anyway, uh, Jerry can. Okay. And we're going to... There. Oh, place. Why won't you let me place it there? There. Boop. Okay. Now, is it going to stand there or just, like, go flopping about? Gas station reach. Where's the gas... Oh, ignition. There we go. Gas station, huh? Okay. Here we go. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Okay, we're good. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Um, I'm going to get off the road and pray I don't die. Oh, it's a deer. Can I just hit the deer? Can I hit the deer? Oh. I... I like meat. I like big meat, and I cannot lie. Oh, dear. Hello. Oh, there we go. Cheating. Okay. Um. All right, let's just go this way. Oh, dear. I did not mean to hit that. Wow, so far this is very realistic. <laughs> okay. And e-brake. <laughs> All right. Uh, ooh. <laughs> okay, let's stop right there. Let's go ahead and uh, get out. And now we're going to... All right. 
Uh, grab this. And there. Oops. Um, I broke it. And, uh, and E to put in. Now what? Is there a trick to start fueling? There we go. Oh gosh, it's taking my money. I have no idea how much money I have. What if I can't pay it? Is there a certain point that it stops itself or? Okay, good. 40 bucks. Is this during the Biden administration or the Trump administration? <laughs> Seems questionable to me. Okay, uh, car filled. Oh, yeah, I didn't. I mean, sure. I mean, yeah, if you, if you want to be like that, sure. Hold R to flip car. Oh, wait. Yeah, we got to flip the car upside down to fill it. There we go. There we go. Quest complete. But how much is this going to cost me? I have a gun. I could just go and, like, rob the place. 26 bucks. That's not so bad. I mean, this is like Grand Theft Auto can uh, branching style, right? Talk with the real estate agent. Okay. Enter car. Which, where do I go for the real estate agent? Oh, I guess we got to start it. Okay. Maybe we'll stay on the road this time, because that worked really well before. I did see that deer, and I did want it. Yes. Okay. This is very difficult to control. Oh! <laughs> E-brake! <laughs> you know what? I'm not even going to bother parking. I'm drawing a UTV. Williams Car Shop. Press E to open the door. Can I just have one of these? This is attractive. How much do you want for it? Welcome. You can buy a car or customize it. For all our new customers, we install radio players in their four-wheelers for only $10. Just drive into the garage in this building. Okay. I still have no idea. Where can I buy a car? What is the difference between cars? <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> When I have no idea how much money I actually have. Okay. Um, let me do this and see if there's a way. Rewards 250 bucks. I have $433. Uh, talk with the real estate agent. Good day. Are you by the chance the new owner of one of the nearby ranches? Yes, that's me. In that case, I must give you the construction manual. This book will help you rebuild your ranch. Keep in mind that construction is only permitted on your ranch territory. Well, that's all I wanted to tell you. Good luck with your ranch. Thank you. Okay. So far, I have done nothing. So, can I get this beast for about 20 bucks? What was outside the window? <gasps> that's just wrong. And I was hung. Is this a usual day here? You guys have visitors at random? And what is up with this? Oh, I get it. This is Big Bang Theory. What's his face lives upstairs, huh? Okay. I just want to see. Eat a top. Continue. Where? How do I buy a car? Use a computer here. Purchase vehicles. So you can't sell me a car? I need to do it myself? Boy, do I feel cheap. $800 to buy one thing that looks exactly like mine? $1,600? What else? What, 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 what other options are there? And I'm going to get rid of this thing there keep forgetting that. Oh, it shows you how many pigs it can carry a cow? How is that possible? Oh, that's fun. Okay. Tiny little pickup. Ooh. Okay, so there are some fun toys here. But not a lot. Okay. I feel like I am ill-prepared to buy any vehicles from you, but if I get you a deer at random, how do you feel about that? Uh, done. Oh, reload. You're taking your sweet time, man. I'm going to go get him. With a pistol. Because that's a good idea. Well, he's messing with everyone, so why wouldn't I? Uh-oh. 
Yeah, that's right. Hold still. Right there. Oh! Did I hit him? I think I hit him. I have no, many, no idea how many bullets I have. Oh, 24. Uh, yo! Stop moving. Yes. He's a big buck too. Um Okay. I want the horns and the meat. Did not mean to shoot my gun. That was an accident, I swear. I will reload above your dead carcass. Okay. Um let's uh tab this and we'll hand and Hold the skin. Oh, nice. Oh. 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 Oh, great. So, um, I'm going to run this out to the street side where I will be able to find it purposefully so I can go get my vehicle. I am way over time here. Sorry, guys, but I do hope you're enjoying it, cause it's it's a new game, you know, it's a new, a new thing, and I'm curious. So, <laughs> okay, uh, E to enter. Here we go. Ignition would help. Ugh! It is so hard to drive this car. Oh, oh. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Okay. It's got dirt on it. I'll have to wash it off when I get home. Ta-da! Uh oh Let's just say the mechanics are rather challenging. Uh, E. Start this thing. Uh, this is the other meat over here, I think. There we go, and out we go. Okay. Okay. Now I'll take my bloody hands and meat and stuff and go and get my radio upgraded. Because <laughs> that's the right thing to do. And spend $10 that I really don't want to spend. They don't understand that a streamer or a gamer doesn't want to worry about copywriting. So if you're going to put in a stereo... It better be copyright free music or else I'm gonna have a fit. Go! Oh, okay. Ooh, wow. Apparently we can do a few things to this. So we can install the radio. So we'll upgrade that. What else? Oh, we can change the color. Let's go with a hot pink. There we go. That way everyone can see us. Thank you for your purchase. You're welcome. Now let me out. Okay. Switch on lights. Ooh, it's a lot of light. Okay, now we can turn on the radio. Hardware store reached. I need to go to the hardware store. Where's the hardware store? Way behind us. Okay. Oh, this feels a bit like Halo. I probably shouldn't have a vehicle faster than this because I can barely control this one. Well, you gotta admit, I'm getting pretty good at drifting. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Open. Ooh, toys. All stores have terminals uh, the, through which we can make a purchase. Go to the terminal and press the action button so you don't have to deal with humans ever in this game because we couldn't afford more than one or two humans. Okay. Okay, so I have 623 bucks, and I can buy a bunch of stuff. Can I buy animals? Food and water? So I'm going to die. Tools. All items. So we can get planks, plates, plates, concrete bags. Okay. Huh, drivable lawnmower. <laughs> it's probably much better than what I'm driving. A stunner. Fun. A meat grinder. <laughs> Not available. A regular lawnmower or a Halloween pumpkin. Okay, cool. I gotcha.
Oh, axe, crowbar, and cheap table saw. Okay. So I need an axe. Axe, crowbar, and a cheap table saw. What if I want the luxury one? Because I definitely can't afford it. All right. So we're going to get these three items. Thank you for your purchase. Okay. And now I'm assuming that I'm going to have to pick them up and put them in my, yep, in my cart. And the problem is I don't have room because I have a bunch of meat. Let's see. Okay. Um, um, oh, were they expecting me to pull in? Fat chance. I will just carry it all the way around the building. And hope I have enough room. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. I have a serious problem here. I have a serious problem here. Um, can I drop this? And then move this around? I really don't want to waste my meat. Uh, yeah, I'm just going to put it on the ground right there, yeah. Okay. Right there. And you... Okay, right there. And the biggest chunk of moolah of them all is going to go... Okay. Yeah. Nowhere. Okay. Uh, open tailgate. Yeah. Does that give me extra space to work with? The answer is yes. Please don't fall out. Okay. Here we go. Yeah, the mechanics need... I need a little practice on the mechanics side of thing. Okay. Boop. There we go. And I'm not that stupid. I'll go drive around and... Well. Okay. Ooh, 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 ooh. Well, the meat's not falling out, so I guess I'm okay. Is it a bad thing to run over a crowbar and an axe at the same time? So that would make me an axe murderer, right? Because I killed an axe? That was bad. It's getting kind of night. Oh. Added to your character. Oh, fun! Didn't even have to worry about putting it in the back of the trailer. All right, enter the car. You call this a car. It's a UTV man. Talk with the seller. Where's the seller? You know, you realize it's kind of, it's like, it's 1947, so what would that be? 19, 12, 30, 40, 15, 7 o'clock, 8 o'clock? It'll be 8 o'clock at night. Usually in Montana, you don't go on people's lands at 8 o'clock at night unless you want to be shot. So we're just going to go... Hmm. Um. Flip car. With everything in it. Do not fall out. Oh gosh, I am superhuman. Um. <clears throat> okay, this is going really well. I'm um, trying to stay on the roads, but I'm wondering if that's even a good idea now that it's... Oh, this way! <laughs> oh, dear. That was a deer. That just... I don't have enough room for meat or else I'd shoot it. Even though this meat's probably going to go bad. And I have... Oh! idea where to even put it. Like, I don't have a fridge or anything, do I? Okay. Okay, so I can pull in here. And that's the cell area. Yeah, that's not realistic at all. Um, so I'm gonna walk all the way around here. Watch it be closed. It's open! Oh, 9 o'clock. What time is it? Well, it's 9 o'clock. Welcome to make a purchase. Use the terminal next in the next room. Purchase items will be outside. For more information and uh, on livestock, view the glossary. 
to sell items, place them in the area next to me, and confirm the sale using the terminal. I'm not even sure what the record is that I'm taking, but okay. Uh, egg basket and two chickens. Okay, so we have an egg basket and two chickens. You realize that I don't have room to put them on my trailer, right? Uh, EDUs. And we're going to go to cart and check out. I am so broke so quick. Okay. So... I have to chase down my chickens. You're chicky chicky. Oh! Wow! That's nice. That's fun. Yes. That makes so much sense. Okay. Let's put this chicken back here. Where I pray it won't fly away. Chickens don't fly. But still. Okay. Let's see. We have a serious problem here. I do not have enough room for everything. Can you, like, go right on the tail successfully somehow? No? Can you go on top of that? You can go on top of the box. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. Can I put you on there? Or here? Or here? Or anywhere? <laughs> I don't want to lose anything. There. And... It won't let me move anything else. Can you, chicken, can you go up there? That just seems like the worst place to grab a chicken. Okay. Uh. You. The animation is so good. Because they're like dancing in time with each other. It's like dirty dancing. Okay, there. Okay, on that chicken, I'll grab it in a second. I want to try and get this basket right here. And then this chicken here. <laughs> it's looking at me. There we go. Okay. All right, back to the ranch. Hang on tight, chickens. I trust that you want to go home with me. Oh. I gotta admit, those lights are almost too bright. Um. <gasps> oh! Sure, that was realistic. Okay, I'm sure, like, there's a road I should probably follow. But what's life without a little midnight excursion? <clears throat> I, I'm, I'm a believer of... Whoa. What did I hit? <laughs> I have no idea. I'm a believer of going linearly. Yes, I'm back at the ranch. Chickens pulled out. Okay. Where do they go? I don't know where they go. Okay. Just put them here, anywhere. Okay. I grab a chicken by the neck. Green food, poor food on the point. Oh, what's this? chicken coop as I hold him by his neck <laughs> I promise I'm not gonna kill you yet I'm just taking you to the chicken coop coo the coo the chicken coo uh, is there a way in in this pitch blackness that none of us can see okay um okay I have no idea What's over here? Um, pick up. P okay. Poor food. <laughs> what? Okay. Uh, pour on the ground. All right. There we go. 
bucket water tank found. I don't understand what I'm doing here. Bucket found. I found a bucket. Water tank found. I found a water tank. I found a tank. I found a bucket. I found a bucket tank. Water tank installed anywhere on the ranch. Bucket of water poured. Wow, this is terrible. Okay, this is going really well. I gotta admit, I'm gonna quit. If you want to see more of this stupid stuff, hit that like button, leave a comment down below, and thank you so much for watching here on Legacy Studio. I am going to sleep. <laughs> All right, God bless you guys. Keep it crispy. First Tim 412. Don't forget, um, we've shifted a lot of stuff around here on the channel. If you want to see my music, go check out the channel called Dorka. Uh, links are going to be in the description below or on my uh, on my channel page. You can go and check it out, and I have them all uh, featured there where you can go get right to them. If you like my stand-up comedy or you want to see my stand-up comedy, go look, out, uh, go look at the uh, Rocky Mountain Collective. Uh, if you want uh, to see my drawings, because I uh, used to be a professional artist at Disney, um, the drawing caricatures, I was contracted out there, then go check out Draw Too Much. All right, all the links are there uh, where you can get to them, and thank you so very much for... Um, it's just sleep in your jeans and your t-shirt, huh? Okay. <laughs> we'll see you next time right here on Legacy Studio. Have a good one, my friends. Bye.